can't believe that you're returning for the reboot of Gossip Girl, Kristen Bell. Just a fun thing to bring that show back. It was an easy yes. You've come such a long way from voicing the gossipy blogger, but you're ready to pick up where you left off. We were stunned when we found out who the real Gossip Girl was, and we definitely weren't the only ones. After hearing your voice for so long, we were convinced that Gigi would look and talk like you in real life, but boy, were we wrong. Come on, Belle, can you just try a little harder? I'm sorry. If I'm being really honest, Rachel, I don't think you can pull off high school anymore. Not only did Kristen Bell lend her voice to Gossip Girl, but she also made a cameo in the final episode of the series. But Kristen wasn't the only celebrity to star on the show, because plenty of big-time celebs briefly joined the cast. Keep watching to find out which Riverdale actress portrayed an Upper East Side Duchess for a total of four episodes. I'm shocked. Lady Gaga you guys talking about Lady Gaga? No, Blair, I'm talking about Gaga Ahmadinejad, first lady of Iran. <laughs> lady Gaga is one of the biggest stars in the world, and back in 2009, she performed her musical number, Bad Romance, for the Upper East Siders. They used to play cards together. Who do you think Poker Face is about? The episode titled The Last Days of Disco Stick starred not one, but two big-time celebs. Bad Romance was one of the biggest hits of 2009. So, Gossip Girl fans totally lost it when Lady Gaga made a cameo appearance on the show. Kristen Ritter In 2009, Kristen Ritter made waves when she played Jane Margulies on Breaking Bad. But that same year, Kristen also scored on a small role on Gossip Girl, in which she portrayed a young Carol Rhodes in the episode titled Valley Girls. As it turns out, both Kristen Ritter and Kristen Bell starred together on Veronica Mars before joining the cast of Gossip Girl. It's not forever. Not once we get Shep's music video on MTV. I'm totally the star. Hilary Duff Hilary Duff has accomplished a lot since leaving the set of Lizzie McGuire, but most of her notable roles was the one of Olivia Burke on Gossip Girl. I grew up on these sets. This crew is like my family. In 2009, Hillary appeared in a total of six episodes. Both Hillary and Lady Gaga appeared in the episode titled The Last Days of Disco Stick. We loved Hillary's scandalous Gossip Girl storyline. Melissa Fumero Melissa Fumera plays the adorkable Amy Santiago on Brooklyn Nine-Nine. It's hard to imagine her acting any other way. I haven't gotten an F since I failed recess in second grade. Teachers need a break too, Amy. We were totally stunned when we realized that Melissa starred as Zoe, a.k.a. Girl Number One on Gossip Girl for a total of three years. Melissa's character acted as one of Blair Waldorf's ladies-in-waiting. It's hard to believe that Amy and Zoe are played by the same actress. Blair's here. You're in trouble now. Britney Snow. Just like Kristen Ritter, Britney Snow appeared in a single episode of Gossip Girl in 2009. Both Kristen and Britney's characters starred in flashback scenes in which Britney portrayed a young Lily Van Woodson. Is this the moment where you fall in love with me? Since then, Britney has gone on to star in movies like Pitch Perfect, 1, 2, and 3, and The Late Bloomer. Matchin' a mix. You may know her as Alice Cooper from Riverdale or Sherry Tinsdell from Gilmore Girls. But to the Upper East Side, she's known as Duchess Catherine Beaton. I wasn't expecting anyone so young. They're so beautiful. Mad Jenna Mick guest starred in four episodes of Gossip Girl in 2008. Her role on the show surely spiced things up. She was the slightly older woman who got all caught up with Nate Archibald. Tyra Banks Tyra Banks rules the runway as the long-standing host and executive producer of America's Next Top Model. But that's never stopped her from landing acting gigs on the side. In 2009, Tyra appeared as Ursula Nyquist on Gossip Girl in the episode titled Dan de Florette. Tyra and Hilary Duff's characters both played actresses on the show. They cannot be allowed to have these documents. I'll distract them while you slip out the back. Ivanka Trump You know you're a big deal when you guest star as yourself on a popular TV series like Gossip Girl. Ivanka Trump is a successful businesswoman and entrepreneur, having her own jewelry and fashion lines amongst many other accomplishments. Ivanka. In 2010, Ivanka briefly appeared in the episode titled Easy J. Rachel Bilson. Just like Ivanka, Rachel Bilson guest starred as herself in the episode titled New York I Love You XOXO. This was back in 2010, around the time Rachel was cast as Cindy on How I Met Your Mother. Rachel and Kristen Bell joined forces to help reveal Gossip Girl's true identity. Wait, Gossip Girl is real? Sebastian Stan. 
Sebastian Stan isn't someone who is easy to forget, but after all the success he had after starring on Gossip Girl, it can be hard to remember that he portrayed Carter Bazin, Serena's boyfriend, on the show. All habits die hard. Today, Sebastian is known for playing a Marvel superhero, Bucky Barnes, aka the Winter Soldier. Here at The Things, we post fun videos about your favorite TV shows, movies, and actors every single day. If you're excited about the Gossip Girl reboot, hit that big red subscribe button to stay in the loop. And don't forget to click that bell to get notified whenever we post a new video. If you're tuning in on your mobile, go on YouTube settings and turn on notifications. And that's a wrap on the 10 celebs you totally forgot were on Gossip Girl. Who is your favorite GG character and who are you most excited to see in the reboot? Sound off in the comments. Thanks for watching The Things, and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. We'll see you next time.